Hello, I'm Adam Barillet and welcome to this Crystal Connections video where we're exploring the crystal rainbow fluorite. Fluorite comes in a whole range of colours including a yellow gold, green, blue, purple, pink and even white. And what makes fluorite really interesting and gives it its main property is the way it grows. It grows in perfect squares. Here's a purple piece and I'll give you your extreme close up. And can you see the little squares that grow naturally in it? Now because of this, this affects its energy and makes all fluorites great for common sense and logic. It helps you get yourself organised and make the right decisions in your life and be very decisive. Whereas other crystals may have a real spiritual effect, fluorite can almost have the opposite. What it does is it helps you get your head out of the clouds and get your life in order. So let's, ex let's explore now how you can use fluorite in your life. Rainbow fluorite having all of its different colours in there helps you organise all different aspects of your life. If you tend to be a bit disorganised or life tends to run you instead of you running your own life, then working with rainbow fluorite, having its energy around you, will help you get structured. What I recommend doing is start writing lists, to-do lists and schedule, making time schedules and hold your fluorite as you're doing it and then wear your fluorite and keep it near you and that'll actually help you to stay organised. Its energy wants you to work in little boxes and get quite structured. So if things are chaotic, this is going to be a great crystal for you to work with. I also find fluorite to be a crystal of what I call discernment. Now what that helps us to do is to work out where we should be devoting our time and our energy. It helps you work out what are angels and what are vampires. Now vampires can be anyone or anything that drains and sucks your energy. There may be people that you leave and after you've dealt with them you just feel exhausted. But also other things, sometimes you know watching TV, maybe drinking alcohol just makes you unmotivated and unwilling to kind of get on with your life. Whereas angels make you feel uplifted after spending time with them. You feel really joyous, you know, motivated. Maybe doing yoga or eating healthy can be an angel. So sit with your, uh, your fluorite and actually contemplate. What in my life is an angel? What in my life is a vampire? And then start to spend more time with the angels and less with the vampires. It'll actually feed your energy instead of drain your energy. This will give you the motivation to start working towards what's important in your life and fulfilling your life purpose. Rainbow fluorite is really great as a study stone. If you've got anything to study for, then make sure you have your rainbow fluorite with you. What I recommend is you grab your rainbow fluorite and the plant that harmonizes with it is rosemary. Rosemary for remembrance, really good for the mind. While you're studying, whatever you need to learn, have your fluorite right near you and also diffuse some rosemary essential oil so you can inhale that. Once you've finished studying, put away the crystal and stop diffusing the essential oil. But then when you have your exam or when it's time to perform whatever you've been studying, you then bring back these two. You have the fluorite near you and then you have that scent of the rosemary. The rosemary will activate the limbic system associated with memories, take you back there. And the fluorite is really good because of its squares and its structure for getting your brain all sorted and keeping everything in boxes so it comes back and your recall is really effective. When the body is out of whack or out of coordination, you can experience pain in different places. And that's where I like to use rainbow fluorite to help remove pain. So what I'll do is I'll find the site of the body where the pain is the most. So say it's a headache. So you'll pop your rainbow fluorite on your forehead. Then what you want to do if you can, to further this a little bit more, make a little healing grid and put four black tourmalines either kind of on 90 degree angles around the fluorite and leave that for about five to 10 minutes and the black tourmaline will help to remove those unwanted energies or that pain. Once you've had that for a while, if you can get some little clear quartz points, put them pointing inwards and then allow them to infuse and energize the fluoride a little bit more. Now, if it's for a friend, you can ask them to visualize this or if it's for yourself, what you want to do is you want to try and visualize the pinpoint, the very cell where the pain is coming from, the center, the epicenter of that pain and keep trying to focus in, on where that pain is. Now, I find especially with headaches, what you'll find is the pain might try and move and dance around as it escapes, but give it five to 10 minutes and you'll actually find that it starts to ease away. Now, rainbow fluorite is good for any part of the body or any pain anywhere in the body. If you want to get really specific, you can use different colored fluorites for different systems of the body. So I like to use yellow or golden fluorite for the digestive system, green fluorite for the heart and circulatory system, blue fluorite for the respiratory system, and purple fluorite can be really good for headaches, pink fluorite really good for arthritis or pain or stiffness as well.
I use rainbow fluorite to get my mind or my mental prowess back on track. When I need to get organized and know what I'm doing, then this is the great crystal. And because the mental domain is ruled by air, this is a great way to cleanse your fluorite. Put it outside on a windy day or pass it through some sage or some smudge or some incense smoke and allow this crystal to bring it back its perfect balance. Now the animal that I work with and call upon when I'm working with fluorite is the skunk. Now when we think of skunk we just think, oh that yucky smell. But in fact, skunk is very um, powerful in deciding who he wants around and who he does not and uses that scent for that. That scent that he will repel humans who he doesn't want around, he'll also use to attract who he does want around and his mates as well. So scent is really important to him. And so be like skunk, decide who you want around you, the angels, and decide who you don't want around you, the vampires, as I mentioned before, and start to be very choosy in your life of what feeds you and nurtures you and what drains you and start making those choices. Now the plant, as I said before, is rosemary and rosemary is really good for the mind and for remembering. So diffuse the essential oil, but also use the plant in cooking or even if you can find a rosemary bush when you're meditating with your fluorite, a great place to be doing that is right near that rosemary bush. Astrologically, fluorite to do with the mind is to do with mercury and mercury rules Wednesday. So any major workings that you're doing with rainbow fluorite, then do it on a Wednesday. Now the great thing about fluorite is it can really help you to focus in meditation as well. If you tend to close your eyes, relax for a few minutes and then start thinking about the credit card or what you're having for dinner or remembering you've got to call your mother, then what you want to do is there's some great activities on my red CD and the get focused and focus with fluorite meditation which is on there will really help you to be able to focus on different things for a lot longer and stop you getting distracted. So if that's a challenge that you've got with meditation, give that one a try. I'll leave the links down below. You can either buy the CD off my website or download it on iTunes. So fluoride, as I said before, is really important in getting your life organized. Now we're often wanting to, you know, reach high realms and talk to the angels, but if you haven't got your physical life together, then sometimes it can be quite chaotic. You know, if our health isn't there, if we've got too much on our plate, if we're feeling drained, then it's really hard for us to spiritually evolve because we haven't got ourselves physically, mentally and emotionally together. Rainbow fluoride will help you do that. What's your experience with rainbow fluoride? I'd love to hear about it, so please share with our Crystal community and leave a comment in the section below. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video. I'm Adam Barillet. Blessed be.